Hey everyone, welcome back to Missy's Enchanted channel. Well, we are back with... <laughs> I know I said I wasn't going to get any more cards, but I couldn't resist. So we went to Barnes & Nobles today. It was me, my sister, and my daughter. And my daughter, she got me a little crystal ball. See? And they got me some cards too. So first let's open the crystal ball. We'll open this. Let's see, it comes with a little book. Comes with a little stand. All right, let's open this. This thing's all messed up. We put the little crystal ball on here. Let's put it on quickly. All right. Not tell you now. <laughs> All right. Let's ask a question. How are the cards going to be? Got to give it a few minutes. Well, not a minute, probably about a second or so. Or a few seconds. Hmm. This thing takes a while. Don't count on it. <laughs> that was cute. Let's see. Let's read this quickly. Magic crystal ball. Let's see. The ancient art of crystal gazing. Crystal balls, a mint history. Scrying. Was it and how to do it? Tips for using your crystal ball. Answers from your crystal ball. So yeah. And it has how many? It has 44. Wait, hold on. Yeah, 44 pages on it. And it says the answers are without a doubt. It is certain. Yes, definitely. Most likely, outlook good. Reply hazy, try again, ask again later. Better not tell you now, cannot predict now. Concentrate and ask again. Don't count on it. My reply is no. My sources say no. Outlook not so good. Very doubtful. So yeah, that's a little crystal ball I got for my daughter today. We had fun today. We end up going... Uh, to a lot of stores today, so that was cool. Yeah, let me shut this off because we don't want it to keep playing. So yeah, we'll put that right there. All right, and now we move on to the cards. This one is Messages from the Murd Maids by Karen K. Artwork by Linda Olson. So yeah, this is what this looks like. And then the back looks like that. Mermaids are the elemental guardians of the sea. They excel in matters of the heart and emotions and wish to share their watery wisdom with the human realm. This beautiful 44 deck offers gentle yet direct solutions to any challenges you might be facing and will guide you to a more harmonious way of living. So dive into the mystical world, open your heart to the mermaids and trust that miraculously transformations can happen. So yeah. All right, let's open them. This is a pot that's not so fun trying to open these things without killing yourself. See what I mean? All right. Okay. Well, this pot wasn't so bad. It says, when you fully open your heart and mind to the mermaids, miraculously transformations can happen. Look at the cute inside of the box. Is that cute? Here's the book that goes with it. And it has, let's see, 119 pages. And it tells you about it. 
introduction the mermaids and me the wisdom of the mermaids about this deck of guidebook how to work with your cards formally bond with your cards getting to know the cards preparing for a reading create a sacred space take a mermaid bath protect and ground yourself breathe love and light practicing protection techniques the golden fish cloak salt water it just goes on and on and on and on we don't want to like read all that right <laughs> All right, and here are the cards. Yeah, let's just take this off. Oh, let's just cut this. Yeah, we'll do it this way. There we go. And this is what the backs look like. They're so cute. And let's get started. The first one is waiting. Let's see if we can get more light over here somehow. All right. Turn away. Let's get the scissors out of here. Truth. Trust. This deck looks like it's going to be really fun to play with. Support. And the colors are really pretty too. Solitude. Relaxation. Recognition. Or recognition, I should say. <laughs> Re-energize. I can use that right now. <laughs> I don't know about you, but it's raining over here. And for some odd reason, the rain gets me so sleepy. I just want to fall asleep. All right. Positivity. Patience. Mystery. That's a good one for that one because mermaids are mystery. Move forward. Miracles. Memories. This one's really pretty. The colors are very vibrant on that one. Magic. Love. Light. Letting go. Innocence. In a knowing hope healing gratitude go with the flow Gentleness, the future, friendship, free spirit, feelings. These mermaids are so pretty. Dreaming, dive deep, discernment, 
decisions. Contentment. This one's pretty. I like the colors on this one. It has a lot of purples and pinks and light blues. Contemplation. Communication. Some of these feel like there's two of them, but there's not. Breaking free. Blessings. <laughs> oh, God. Be spontaneous. Awareness. Ask for help. Acceptance. And the last card is Abundance. We're going to shuffle them and see what it has to say. And we'll take a look at the, the booklet. All right. They're going to be hard to shuffle. Hold on. Let's shuffle it this way. Just want to shuffle them pretty good. What vibe does this deck give us? What vibe does the deck give us? Let's see. All right. And we got contentment. Well, that's a good one. And of course, it's the favorite one that I liked because I love the colors on it. Cool. Let's read it, see what it has to say. All right, contentment. It has a little thing over here. Count your blessings to stay in a place of contentment. Feeling content is a wonderful feeling. Enjoy this time, dear friend. You've earned it. And then it says this serene mermaid is totally at ease as she sits on a bridge with the light from the lighthouse shining in her direction illuminating her blessings and helping her to feel deep gratitude for her life situation. The bridge gives her the perfect vantage point from which she can view her surroundings. Clearly, the sea is calm and is a reflection of her life right now. Contentment is a feeling many people strive for. Being in a state of deep satisfaction with everything, how wonderful is that? If this is how you're feeling at this time in your life, then enjoy this well-deserved accomplishment. Continue to be grateful and appreciate this beautiful experience. If you feel anything but content, then this mer mermaid swims into your cards today to remind you that contentment is possible. Just a slight change of mind, a different perspective can shine new light on your life so that contentment can be easily within your reach. Contentment isn't a permanent place of being, but it's certainly a welcome resting point in your journey. So enjoy it when it comes and help to make it last by counting your blessings and showing gratitude for the good things in your life. Experiencing love can bring about great feelings of contentment and unconditionally loving yourself can also produce similar feelings. Falling in love with life itself can give one of the deepest feelings of contentment and combine with gratitude. So yeah, that's cool. This is, I like this deck, this is very pretty. And I'm also going to have fun using them when I do my readings. So, yeah. And this crystal ball is so cute. Let's, let's ask it one more thing. Let's see. Let's put it on for a second and ask. All right. How is, two, how is 2020 going right now? Woo. I wonder why it doesn't want to tell us now. I mean, we could all figure out how, you know, 2020 is going right now, right? All right. Let's see. One more question. What can we ask? Uh, how's the next couple of days going to go for us? Got 
this doesn't really tell you a lot, guys, huh? All right, let's shut it off. <laughs> this is just a cute little thing that I got today. Something just to add when I, like, you know, do my little videos and everything. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. If so, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and have fun. Stay safe. And thank you for watching, as always. Bye. Mwah. See you later.